Yo, check it out. I'm getting ready to share with you how to get more appointments for your business within an appointment funnel. So stick around because you're going to want to see this if you want a lot of appointments coming your way. Yo, what is up? Zachary Babcock here, former drug addict, spent over five years of my life in prison, turned underdog entrepreneur and the Prove Em Wrong prodigy and top 200 iTunes podcast host. What is up? Welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here and you want the best tips on how to turbocharge your business with lead generation, customer acquisition, hit the subscribe button, tap the bell notifications, that way you don't miss anything. With that being said, we're about to dive into how to get a lot of qualified appointments coming into your funnel. Uh, with an appointment funnel, do you, would you like more appointments in your business? See, a lot of people, they're doing this wrong. It's a really simple four-step process that's going to get qualified people, the people that you need to be talking to so you're not wasting your time so that you can make more sales. So with that being said, let's head to the com, uh, to the slide deck. And let me show you how, how, to, how it's done. This is exactly how an appointment is, funnel is set up. It's very, very simple. Um, very, um, very simple to do, which makes it great uh, to implement. However, a lot, of, a lot of entrepreneurs are doing this wrong. So you start off with a lead magnet, which is something of value that you give to them uh, in exchange for their email address which that lead magnet leads to the funnel. They come to your funnel. If they want the lead magnet, they opt in. If they don't, then uh, they, just, they just leave and they don't get it. Now, once they opt in, they have a choice to uh, to schedule an appointment with you. You done gave them the lead magnet, which is adding value to them. Now they can come down straight to the appointment or they may not be ready to book the appointment just yet. And that's what the follow-up emails are for that you send them once they opt in. You're going to be sending them follow-up emails likely for the next five days that are going to be pushing back towards the appointment. Now, once they come to the appointment, you help them. Uh, you show them exactly how to implement a certain thing about your business, your coaching, your your service um, that you're providing. This works for service providers. Um, amazing. Uh, and then you offer your paid implementation program uh, or your your service at the end if it's a good fit. And that's exactly how it's set up. So the lead magnet, the funnel, and the follow-up emails are only the what. And what do I mean by that? Uh, it's the what and the why. You, you don't go into how because you have to leave it uh, compelling enough for them to actually want to come speak with you. And um, everybody's situation is uniquely different. So if you get to explain it into the house, too general, it's not specific, uh, and you're going to lose out on a lot of appointments. So in the lead magnet and your funnel and your follow-up emails, you're going to explain what your product is and why they need it. Um, hit on their pain points and their desires. Um, next up is the appointment. That's the actual how. Now you have them in appointment. This is the perfect situation, a perfect selling situation. And it's, it's, it's perfect to first off, see if they're a good fit for your program. Um, and second off, provide, provide a tremendous amount of value, uh, and help them. You actually help them, uh, show them exactly how to implement, um, your service, how it's actually done. And at that point, they can um, they can go and implement it on the, by themselves, which will cost a lot of trial and error and probably more money in the process and more time. Or they can hire you for your paid program uh, where you actually help them or provide the service, and that's the actual help. So the lead magnet funnel and follow-up emails are the what and the why, what your, your product and service is and why they need it. The appointment is how to implement it. You actually show them how to do it step by step. You give them the blueprint, the roadmap, and the paid implementation program is the help. Uh, hopefully that makes sense. Now, what do you need for an appointment funnel? So you need a lead magnet. And uh, you can check out that card in the top right corner uh, if you want to know how to build out a lead magnet, a highly converting lead magnet. I recommend using something like Canva and uh, um, easy video software uh, service and make it a hybrid like I explained in my uh, lead magnet video where you give them uh, a, 
a lead magnet where you roll out everything, what your product or service is, and then a video tutorial, which is more of a deep dive showing them exactly what it is, and it's more of a push towards the appointment, and also maybe some downloadable worksheets, if that makes sense. That hybrid right there, you're adding a massive ton of value to them, and they see that you're dressed up very nicely and came to play like a pro. Secondly, you need a squeeze page funnel, also known as like an opt-in page or a landing page, some type of funnel where you can uh, capture their email and send them or more emails to their email address uh, once they opt in. Uh, and I recommend ClickFunnels. Uh, it's the best software in my opinion. Uh, you could do everything. All the, you could build out all your sales pages, webinar pages, uh, membership sites, all that in ClickFunnels and store and keep all of your uh, your email contacts within there. It's all one place and it's just it's it's amazing. Um, I'm gonna link up in the top right corner a playlist for ClickFunnels which I'll show in that playlist you also know how to build a sales page a squeeze page uh, and a bunch of other cool things inside of ClickFunnels it's right there right now in the top right corner for ClickFunnels third thing you'll need is a location to have an appointment or a phone or video conference uh, I do all mine on Zoom um, we do them in a small group format um, you could scale better that way and um, you know works uh, works amazing because it's still like a face to face it's close to a face to face you're on video with them and you're able to help and interact with them and give them specific feedback fourth thing you'll need a sales page uh, once again I already put the card up there for click funnels um, on how to build a sales page easily a high converting sales page uh, that way you can actually get them to your page to see your offer um, and show them that your product uh, can help solve their problems and or achieve their goals and that way you can take the payment right there and then um, enroll them into your program or sell them on your service and then fifth you need your product or service that you're going to be um, selling in the first place obviously so that's something that you'll, um, you'll, you'll need to come up with and that is an appointment funnel. All right, did, did that make sense? Does the appointment funnel make sense to you? If it does, let me know in the comments below. Um, and if it doesn't, tell me why. Tell me why it didn't make sense. Let me know where I can improve. Let me know what you're missing so that uh, I can improve upon these in the future. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. If it sucked, hit it with a thumbs down. I really want your honest opinion, your honest feedback on this. Uh, if you haven't already subscribed to this channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the bell notifications only if you want the best tips on how to turbocharge your business with lead generation and customer acquisition. Until then, until the next video, I will see you soon and you can check out these videos. Until then. We put them hours in to bring them dollars in. It's that underdog empowerment. We put them hours in to bring them dollars in. My name is Zachary Bell.